morning, good afternoon, good evening. I think we are, we're looking for our elements. There's one more, right? There's a particular fire elemental that is been giving us trouble. And I think that's what's, that's what we're doing today. So let's do our uh, morning prep. If I guess if that's what you want to call it. The standard outward before you leave anywhere. <laughs> what are we bringing? What do we have? All right, let's see here. All right, um, do we have any more ghost eyes? We do, okay. Let's take care of this real quick since we I see it. Okay. I should be able to get rid of both of those. And I need a, I don't got a hex cleaner, okay. Uh, I'm going to keep two of these innocence potions because after I wake up, I'm going to take a quick sleep in the tent. I'm going to take one. I, I got to remember not to take it before you sleep because anytime you sleep, it, it removes all of your buffs. So hold on. Okay, got two of those. How many beetles do I have? Six beetles. Okay, so I don't need two of these. Okay. Water, okay, don't need that. How do I make, um, since we're here, the fire varnish? Ooh, seared rot, okay. Do I have quite a bit of the smoke rot? I was like, I don't know if I've got any. A lot of, uh, I got two here. Do I just take those? Quite a few. Let's do two more. Yeah, just two more. I know I held on to them for a bit, but they started to expire. Okay, so let's cook those. Oh, I need the Gabri wine. I kept some of those, right? Possibly. Yep. Cool. Do I need to make more? I don't think I need to make more anymore firestones. I have like four in here. So that means I got to put these back though. All right, so these weigh like nothing, and they're really good for the pressure plate trap. Same with these. And I should, probably don't need three of these. These are good, too. Let's put those away. This is all good. I like that. I don't need this. I'll keep these. Okay, five. And one, I like it, okay. Do I have any more bread of the wild? One or two more, okay, okay. The bouillon, I like the bouillon just for extra stamina. Um, before, like while I'm running around, if that makes sense, or, or needed. So it's like I'm running around outside. In the winter, I use the Gabri Tartine because it's got uh, the weather, cold weather bonus. And then the bouillon, it doesn't do anything. Um, it gives us like physical attack buff, but since we don't use physical attack, um, I like to use it for its stamina because it's got four stamina. And then when I get into like the big fights, I use the bagatelle because this has got five. So let's see, do I need another? 
I have only one of those. Let's see. I think I can use another discipline. F here, here we go. Angel food cake. Okay. And then I don't have anything more to make alpha. I have no alpha meat. Let's see. What do you need? Buy all this. This stuff is just too good, and I don't have to make it. And then I'll check the chef. Oop, wrong button. I'll check the chef on the other side to see if he has any alpha meat. I don't think he does, though. It's our weight, 59. All right. Hey! Um, is it... Oh, forgive me for... For, I'm going to try to pronounce your name. I'm so sorry. Is it uh, Elena? E Elaine? I can't do the, the full thing. I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll take, I'll take a, a, a look at everything uh, after the stream for that. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, please let me know if I uh, mispronounce uh, your name. I don't mean to offend. Well, there's some alpha jerky, but no alpha meat. What about recipes? Nope. But, uh, but thanks. Um, should I take the, you know, I'm going to take the perpkins and then I can put them away because they're good too. We are, uh, doing our morning preparation before we head out into the world. It's just good, uh, outward practice. I figured the best time to do it is to do all that, uh, before... Uh, right in the morning when I start up. That way, if anybody trickle in, they don't have to see too much too much of the downtime. There we go. Get all the perpkins in there. All right. How's our water? Water's good. Okay. How are we looking? Need some sleep. Need some food. Where's a ration? Do I have a ration? Um, I don't see any rations. What, I can make two of these, right? So let me take two of these and then salt. Perfect. Yep, there's our hungry. Okay, cool. So now I can eat these instead. All right, excellent. Let's take a quick, quick nap here. Uh, we'll do two. There we go. And then we can uh, go out and take a look at that uh, clock tower flame or the clock tower bonfire. All right. So sleep is good. Food, we'll eat one more. And then while we're at it, we're going to use one of these. And we'll put the ration back. Now that we're heading out, we don't need the ration. And then we're going to use the water. Cool. All right. So we're just looking for an elemental. Um, this flame needs to be uh, the red fire. And hopefully we can get our last elemental so that we can start this. Because if I can get a purifying quartz, we can finish our enchant. And then uh, talk to this Rust Lich. So I'm going to get the Tartine anyway, just for a quick. There we go. A little bit of extra stamina cost reduction. And then I brought a tent with me too, right? Yeah. Let's, uh, whoops. No, 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 don't stop. Oh, man, there's a golem chasing you. Don't stop. But yeah, okay. So I brought a tent. That way if we can sleep out here. I'm going to lose my good, like, bed buff. But 
I don't know what else to do. Because this is the last color that I need. And I keep, uh... I keep getting the shaft, man. It's not, like... Uh, spawning for me. Okay, so it's red still. Let's go. Let's go. Hopefully, he's out and about. It'd be great if he's just, like, right around the corner. Okay, I'm going to check over here first. I like to check near the... I get the lantern, I guess you could say. Because that's supposed to be their main one. Um, thank you for the follow. Um, goodness. You're going to have to tell me how to say your name. Is it... Uh, uh, if I, is it alright if I just say... Is it Genie? Can I, can I shorten it to that? Please let me know. I don't want to uh, offend anybody, but thank you so much again. I appreciate the follow. Um, we are looking for an elemental that keeps giving us the jukes. He's not right here. I'm going to go on the other side of the houses. Let's see. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's uh, something I put down. Okay. Yeah, there's another spot potentially on the other side of the houses over here. Yes, thank you again for the follow. Nighttime is kind of the best time to find them because the, all the stuff out here like glows. So it's easier to see the elementals with their flame color. But it looks like I may end up be uh, sleeping to reset this thing. For some reason, I feel like it's stuck on the red. Uh, the flame, the clock tower flame, that is. All right, there's one more spot. Let's go up here. Right, yeah. Just in case. I don't know if it gets up this high, but... We're going to check it again. Nothing over here. I don't know if he can go all the way this way, but... Okay. Alright, it looks like we're sleeping. That's just what we're going to have to do. I got colder. What do I have? I have 44 cold weather resistance. And it's still cold. You know what? It's probably like 45. That's probably the, the magic number. Which would be funny. One short. All right, so we're gonna go back to the clock tower and we're gonna lay out our tent, which we'll probably need, you know what, we'll probably need a fire just because our tent's not um, sufficient for cold weather. So we'll make a fire here. Make sure we stay warm. It will keep us uh, fed and hydrated, but that's about it. So 
my guess is when we do this, it's going to, there's going to be a couple like nights or days where we are, nope, I'm trying to stay away from these golems. I may have to, you know what, let's take them out real quick. I feel like that's just the smart way to do it. Let's eat one of these. Wick potion. Perfect. Now we don't have to worry about them because that would have been a pain to have to uh, to deal with those guys. All right. So what's my cold weather now? Oh, so, so now it's okay. We're going to stay in this one then. This armor is a little better. It's just not really good for movement. So let's put the fire down here. And let's see, where's our tent? Get a nice plant tent going. Start the fire. Let's see, let's put our bag down and sleep. Let's start with one hour. Let's see what happens. Because I know there was like an ambush. I guess I could have done one hour of sleep, one hour of um, guard. We'll see what happens. I think the worst thing to ambush us is going to be beast golems. Oh, okay. Whoa. This is a little more than expected. Keep this going. All right, it's still red. Should we take a look real quick? I, it, this may be something where I have to end up. Um, I'm trying to think. What's the best way to get rid of this? You know what, let's drink some water and we may have to end up, let's drink this one right here, eat this food. I may have to do like, uh, I may actually have to quit to the main menu for like a, a fix. Cause there's two ways of, well, I guess you could say three. There's three ways of technically resetting it. The main one is just moving in and outside of like dungeons or um, like Hermatin, just like zoning. And then it's supposed to switch, right? The other way is to sleep for an hour. And then the third way is to um, go to the main menu and load it again, which we may have to do because I don't know if it's like stuck or bugged on the flame. Cause at this point I kind of want it. I want to see like either a different flame or no flame just to know that it's actually rotating.
Uh, do I have a palladium scrap? I don't. That's okay. I was just going to say we can make our golem rapier. But we don't. Uh, we don't have a palladium. So I think I think that's what we're gonna do. I think we're gonna quickly just do a couple um, exit to the main menu. Um, I don't want to fight those. <laughs> I don't want to fight the golems. Yeah, for some reason I feel like the flame is bugged. That's the red, right? That's definitely red. Okay, so let's do this. Let's go back to the main menu. And then we'll start up again. So if it's the red one again, I may try doing this one more time and sleeping. just to get a different flame. I think it just it needs to reset, right? Okay. So let's sleep an hour. Ooh, let me take off my backpack real quick. Oh, hang on. There we go. We'll do it like that so now that there's no ambush. Okay, perfect. It worked. Okay. So do we see that? So we don't see any flame now. Right? It's all gone. Okay, so now what that means is, is essentially um, there are five elementals. And the only one that I need is the fire one. And so what that means is, is that it is currently on a rotation where I already killed that elemental. So now I just need to sleep until the fire one shows up again, and that way I know that it reset to, uh, it reset the flame, like it reset the fire. Okay, so there we go. Now, if we're, hopefully if we're quick enough, we can get over there and he's not like, I don't know, stuck in a house or um, getting defeat by other enemies, like golems or Potentially like the wolf gang. Let's see if we can do this. Oh, was that that? Did I see him? There he is. Yep. Cool. All right. All right, now if we're lucky, he'll give us a purifying quartz. That's what we need. We need a purifying quartz. Get out of here. Okay, he didn't give it to us, which is fine. However, now... We can do the similar. Actually, you know what? I was like, I don't want to mess with this. Get out of here. These guys are a pain. They're tough and they're fast. All right. 
And can I wait? Hold, can I break one down? No, I cannot. Like I, I need a palladium. I can make. I may have to just drop them off over here. All right. So now we're gonna do the same thing. We're going to um, sleep. Um, do we need to repair? I don't think we really need to repair. Nope. But this time we're waiting for the flame to turn white. And that means that all of the elements that we fought are now going to be up here. All five of them. And we can uh, kill all five of them again for more particles as well as a chance at some purifying quartz. So that's what we're hoping for now, the white flame. There it is. Yes. This is working out so much better than last time. Perfect. This also means, I don't know if anybody was watching, um, I think last stream, we had the lightning elemental and we found him however we weren't able to reach him in time and um the kazite bandits actually found him and killed him but we were in the vicinity we were like right next to it when it happened so we got the loot, but we didn't actually kill him. So what this means, though, I guess for anybody watching, as long as you're within the vicinity of it dying, it will recognize you as the that flame being taken care of, if that makes sense. So you don't have to worry about whether or not you actually took the killing blow, but as long as you were able to loot it, then it should um, check mark that elemental. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Let's drop this one. All right, so we really need a quartz. some regular fish for uh, pungent paste. It's hard to uh, hard to use the rainbow trout for pungent paste knowing what it gives. Alright, so we need to make sure we have all of our buffs. I have a, a, a ceviche, right? Yeah, okay. I'm going to need extra elemental buffs. And I'm definitely going to need my protection and everything I can kind of throw at it. Because these guys, whoops, these guys are going to snipe me. Uh, yeah trying to think oh maybe I can bring some of these guys over to help out with the fight he's gonna stop my prep work though okay, hang on a minute hang on a minute um, I can put some actually can I climb up here yeah okay are you gonna climb up here all right cool you it nope you weren't supposed to do that. Um, let's see here. Oh. 
buffs. Ceviche. Uh, let's see, Beetle. I'm going to take a, a Perpkin too. Oh, get out of here. I'm trying to buff. And what else? What else? Here we go. Warming food. Okay, what else? Um, I think that's it, right? I think I'll eat this one. Let's make our sword. Make sure that we we'll put this on again just to make sure it's there. And okay. Now let's go get that guy. Hey, now I'm ready. Let's go. Can we pick off anybody? The ice one is just kind of hanging out over here. Oh my goodness, it's targeting. Oh, he's stuck. That's great. Oh, he's on the bird. Oh, I think my sword hit killed the bird. They were on the bird. Let's see if we can't get over here now. Quickly. All right, so I got the ley line, which is kind of bad. There we go. Perfect. Okay, yeah, because the ley line increases my mana... Um, usage, but I have one. There we go. Dreamer shirt. Perfect. All right. So R and Jesus, we can do it. Okay. Not that one. Not that one. Let's see, I got three more. We need one. We just need one. Oh, well, I got a palladium scrap. No, one more. Oh, that's just bad luck. Okay. That is bad luck. Not a single purifying quartz. Okay, so now... Oh, man, I don't even... You really can't... There's nothing that drops them, right? There's one one enemy that has a hundred percent chance of dropping it however it's in caldera and i am not gonna go there um and then come back up here because the enchant that we need the last enchant is for the antique plate boots and you have to be out in the antique plateau right for the economy so what i'm gonna do is <clears throat> we're gonna we're gonna prepare ourselves how long we've been it's 36 minutes we're gonna go home and prepare ourselves for the final rust lich battle and at the end of that um dungeon before you get to the rust lich there is a shield golem that has a chance of dropping the purifying cords. So we can, that's the only other enemy that I know that we can try to get, right? So we're gonna try to do that. Let's make our way back home. We can actually go up here. What am I doing? Instead of going the long way around. This is kind of the shortcut.
cool. I don't know. I always like doing the clockwork puzzle. It gives me some issues sometimes. Um, but I mean, honestly, it should be semi straightforward, right? You know, check the flame, kill the elemental, and then once you kill them all, the flame should turn white. Uh, most of the time, it's pretty straightforward, but... I, wish, I really wish you could cook here. How cool would that be? Um... Alright, let's see. Let's grab some water. And probably just repair, right? We'll pay for a repair. Sell this, uh... Want to buy something? Golem rapier. Can I get a... No. We got some more predator bones, which is great. Want to buy some... All right. Want to buy something? All right. All right. All right. Pouch overweight. Yep. Okay. All right. Let's see here. We got to plate him in here, don't we? Yeah, because we have two of these, which we can break down anyway. I'm still on the lookout for more... Um, Occult remains, right? Oh, I have two? Okay, hold on, hold on. Two, which means I need four of these. Right, and then I need two of these. Um, and then I need two more of these. And then I just need the weapons, right? One, two, should be enough. We got more money. We got more money. Need something? I do. Can you can we do this? Yep, definitely can. Can I help you? Yes, please. I need your money, buddy. Is there something you need? Look at that. Oh man, he's got three mage tents. That's crazy. Oh, he sells alpha jerky too? I'll take that. There you go. We have all the monies. Uh, what was I going to say? I was going to do 20, but instead we're going to do 18. Yeah. Let's see how much money do we have 194 technically a lot more with this we got 196 well i mean i guess we got 204 i wasn't counting this 10. let's take this because there's a couple things i want to sell let's put this here and seven yep okay let's put all these away don't need those don't need okay let's do some prep here Let's uh let's sell this stuff. It's gonna bother me. What do you need? Okay, is there anything else? No, we need this food for Okay. Oh wait a minute. I got that. Well, what silver. do you need? Right, yeah. All right, so let's see here. Got discipline potion. Got a golem elixir. Need a couple more mana potions just in case. I'm gonna bring that one just in case. Where we're going is kind of a lengthy dungeon to get up to the rust lich. So I think what I'll do also is take an extra one of these. To get rid of any corruption. Um, I only need one of these. Because I have the 
food. I'm gonna actually put that back. I have enough beetles. I don't need that. Let's see, let's put this way. I want another ceviche. Do I have another one in here? No. Let's make one. This. How do you make the ceviche? It's, um, this seaweed and just like water or uh, salt. Let's find out. Looks like it might be salt. Yeah. There we go. Just for some extra elemental. I think I want another boiled perpkin. Those are really good when you need it for that extra impact since our impact is so low. I gotta make sure to take those out to Caldera with me. Still got my paste, okay. Do we have any more bouillon? I don't think we're gonna need it. But it was kind of a an extra stamina. I'll take the fungal cleaner. Because we don't have a poise, an antidote. There we go. Do you think that's it? I think that's all we really need. Anything else? Any I got all the keys. Okay, alpha jerky. We'll just do three. Okay, perfect. So let's get our better sleep in. And then we can head over. Alright. I'm going to stand up and stretch real quick. Get a quick stretch in. All right, cool. So now we're gonna go to the warehouse, right? The Probably the fastest way to get there. How's our water? Good, how's our teas actually real quick? Teas are good, okay. Teas are good, we probably don't need, let's remove these. Okay, there we go. We don't need the, the poison varnishes. Since uh, anything that we put in the pressure plate's probably going to be like the fire one or the frost one. And our weapon comes with decay on it. Let's see here. Water, fire, and a tartine. So we're going to go say hello to the Rust Lich, and then hopefully, between all the enemies and the chests and the junk piles, we find at least one Purifying Quartz. That's the goal. That is our current objective.
Excellent. We made it. All right. I think I don't think it's been a week since so all these guys should still be uh Still be dead. They shouldn't be... Yep. Alright, cool. Looks like they shouldn't be hanging around here. We're gonna have to refill our lantern soon. All right, cool. Train cars right down here. How is our lantern? Now that I mentioned that, uh, how many? I've got two. Okay, we can do that. Refill it real quick. All right, the least the research laboratory. Cool. I think there may be a uh, immaculate hiding in here. Yep, I think I see him right there. Let's see. Let's get rid of him so we don't have to worry about any of his shenanigans. Let's eat the beetle. Let's do the pottage, yeah. Because the pottage gives, what is that? That's uh, 25, yeah. Because the cheek, cheesecake gives 30, I believe. No, sir. There we go. Okay. Oh. Nice. Quick chunk. Right. Oh, cult remains there. Okay, so that's who, uh, that's the big offender of the cult remains. Gotta remember that. Is there anything else hiding in here? A chest, okay. Purifying quartz. Oh man. All right, let's take those. All right, what about the other side, real quick? We we put all the keys in. Just need to turn on the the big one. Take the predator bones. Uh, you know, I don't I don't need these. I mean, I would take that, but the blacksmith sells it, and I don't want to um, carry that with us. Because that's like five weight we really don't want to carry. Let's 
some of this stuff I'm picking up now I don't need, but I can get rid of anything on the way up. Alright, here we go. Time to open the big door. Is because I enjoy a living, why do you think I adventure? Doc! Hey, man! Thank you so much! Um, I don't know if I have uh, too many people here this morning, but thank you so much for the... For the raid, man. I appreciate it. What, uh... They're playing Risen 2, okay. Yay, no worries, man. Hey, I, I appreciate uh, you just coming in and, and either raiding or just lurking or saying hi. Much, much appreciated. Thank you so much. How was your stream, though? I saw you on. I was lurking in there for a little bit. I don't know too much about Risen 2 before I started. Let's see. What are we prepping for now? Bandage. But yeah, I hope you're. I hope it went well. Get another water. And we'll get rid of that burnt stamina here. And let's eat one of these. Uh, fun pirate game, but kind of my guilty pleasure. Okay, excellent. I'll have to go back over your VOD. Uh, later today while I'm like eating lunch or something to take a look at it. I always like uh, um, Like I guess you could say like janky or older games. They have like a lot of character to it. So that's fun. Well, that's awesome, man We are headed up to the rust lich and I'm just making sure I have some good buffs. I know I'm missing some stuff here. Actually, I need to buff up pretty well. Because I believe there's an illuminator, like, right up there. Let's get some cheesecake. And we'll eat one of these. Uh, it's a little difficult when you have a melee weapon early on. But once you get a rifle, you kind of steamroll again. Oh, yeah? That's awesome. Yeah, that'll probably make uh, a lot more sense when I see it. That's cool. Let's get rid of these lackeys here. Oh, no, they heal. The heal. Got to punch. Uh, Got to go. Yeah, thanks. No, no worries at all, man. Thank you much, Doc. I appreciate um, anything um, that you bring over or just saying hi. Take care, man. Have a great day. All right, cool. Now we can face this dude. Let's make sure we uh, still have our protection. Oh, 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 that does so good. Nope, there we go. There we go. That did such good um, impact. There we go. Perfect. Okay, so he didn't give us a purifying quartz, which is fine. That's not the guy that we were kind of expecting to get one off of. So let's, um, should I eat, drink one of these? Uh, I may need to. Let's get, let's do this and we will do um, a healing potion. And what's, how long do we have this sapped for? Okay, so we're fine. Ooh, more cheesecake, delicious. How's our mana recovery? Mana recovery three, okay. All 
All right, what else is up here? I know that there's a sublime horror with a decay elemental that uh, hangs out up here. You know what? I'm actually going to drink this. And I'm going to drink one of these. Just because I'm close to that 25% uh, um, twenty five percent tainted. All right, let's see. Can we bring a ghost around? Okay, so I know that there's guys fighting over. So the the sh the sublime shell is right around this corner. Let me prepare a little bit, cause he's one nasty dude. Let's eat this and a little more protection. There we go. Perfect. Take off my lantern. There we go. Alright. I don't think he bleeds, but... Oh, uh, not the ghost. Yeah, come to me. Come to me. Leave the ghost alone. Come over here. I have all these beautiful traps set up for you. Oh. oh, no, no. So much damage. Got him. Okay. The ghost, you did well. I appreciate you. No elemental. Or no particle. That's right. He, uh... Distracted the elemental, which is great. Because taking both of those on is a huge pain. Alright, now we can go see what these guys are doing. What is my um, weapon? Yep, okay. what he was looking for. I'll take that. There's somebody fighting somebody. Right, do you think we can get another ghost? Oh, okay. Oh, there they are. We'll take all that. All right, we'll come back to those guys. Get him, spaghetti dude. Saw that golem and the elemental in there. Okay. What is? Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. Take that. Get him, Elemental. Okay, okay, that's good. Take that. No, come back here. Oh. Oh, he's stuck. Ha <laughs> ha. 
I don't think I'm gonna take that. I don't need those. That's just more weight that I don't need. Oh, he's still looking at him. Can I get through this minefield? Yep. Get out of here. Okay. Nothing. Nothing good. Take those. Okay, we're looking good so far. Looking good. Man is still coming along. I know that there's uh this place um, I found out has a whole lot of secret doors. I don't know if you uh, if you guys knew that chat. There's a lot of like um, secret secret switches to open up doors, and I don't know if I think you may need to defeat the Rust Lich first. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Um, I'll take two of these. I don't think I want... Yeah, I'm already... Oh, my bag's overweight now. Let's see. Oh, it's because of this. Alright, I'll get rid of these. I hate to do that, but they weigh so much. Let's take a ghost with us. See, is there another one? Nope. Nothing in here. Yeah, there's a lot of lore in these. Uh... Take all this. In these secret uh, doors that open up. That one was one. I... I'll have to keep checking around. That's the one that I remembered. There's a couple other. I think one. I want to say there's like two, maybe three more doors you can open. Oh, spaghetti dude's going ham. There we go. Okay, I don't need that. Where did my ghost go? Did he get trapped again? Like, did he get stuck? Maybe he'll come with me. Nice. Okay. All right, so I'm out of the corruption. Um, but I'm still... Um, I don't think I want to use my stuff yet. Let me go through all this food to make sure that I have everything. Let's buff up on some extra cheesecake. Gravel beetle. Okay, and then we can... Do our booms. Yep. Oh. I see him. Nope. There he is. Oh, the ghost is... Oh. Oh my goodness. I'm getting ambushed. Ghost, help me. There we go. Get out of here. Oh, did you like that? Oh, you see that setup? That was great. Nice job, ghost. Okay. I probably could have made a... I definitely could have made a... Like a... A normal... Golem rapier by now, but that's alright. Like I said, we're not really hurting for money. I think we have more money than we did our last run. So let's see here. What is... 
I'm trying to think if there's another... particular door that we open. Oh, okay. Where did that one open? Out of here. Okay, let's see here. All right, we know it did something. We just gotta find... Okay, oh, oh, is that it over there maybe? Did I see that back there? So we pulled the vase in there and did it open a door right here? Oh, wow. Oh, an ornate chest, too. Okay. Oh, totally. Get a quartz. No! Monarch incense. Man, I needed that quartz. All right, there's still a chance. Okay. Is he stuck? Come on, ghost. I need you for the ba the battles to come. Oh, he can't get past the door? Oh, man. this ga Oh, there he goes. Okay. There we go. Okay. We're good. All right, so that's two secret doors. And I have a feeling that I might have missed one already. Uh, I don't want to take that perkin. Ow. Let's uh let's heal this. Drink one of these since we have an abundance of them. Bandage as well as um the dry mushroom bars. Here we go. For any anything out of the ordinary, I feel like there's more. I need you to get my trap. I put the trap down. It's a beautiful trap. Come over here. No ghost. Alright, let's see. What else is hiding around here? Any more levers? Oh, oh, what's this? Is that a door? This guy's stuck. What would I do to maybe open that door? If that is a door. Yikes. Is there a chest here? Okay. Is 
author of book. Those are always cool, right? Pull a book, opens a door. All right, so the, the golem that we were talking about earlier is in that area. It's up here and to the right. That guy doesn't have a soul? Nope. Okay. Can you come out here? There we go. Alright, let's see if we can't quickly buff up so that that way um, we can fight this guy for what we can... I think is like the only chance for us to get a purifying quartz. So let's see here. These. Drink one of these. I have, yep, I need my blade real quick, come on, there we go, reset that, and now I think, yep, there he is, Got him. Okay. Oh, I actually don't have a dreamer's root for this because this is this could be. I was like, this could be bad. Okay, great. All right, please, please. No. Why? Why have you forsaken me? Take that. We got two particles, and that's good, but. Oh my goodness. Are we really gonna have to do this? I mean, I, ha I have the armor, right? But the enchant is so good. I need the enchant. Alright, here he is. Let's not. Let's not. Sounds like I'm getting near the source of the trouble. Then there's no point in talking anymore. Alright, so we have a corpse here for um, a ghost, but as far as I know, I've never been able to get the ghost to get into the fight. So what I'm gonna do is, our sleep is good, our armor is okay. I don't have a bed to put here. So instead what I'm gonna do is um, continue the fight right here. I'm gonna drink. And then we're going to rebuff everything real quick. And then use this corpse as mana. So let's, um, let's buff everything. There we go. Drink this. And let's see here. Uh, impact of your attacks. Deal... Oh, physical damage? Okay, I don't need that. Let's just drink this one to get it out of here. Should we drink this to... Oh, I didn't do anything. That's all right. All right. We're coming for the Rust Lich. Everybody grab your popcorn. What else do we want? Do I already have impact up? Let's eat the beetle. Oh, I did, didn't I? Let's see. What else? Physical... Um, I already have that discipline and did I eat let's eat the cheesecake 
Hey, I'm Yorn. What's going on, man? Oh, yeah, of course. Of course. I want to, uh, at the end of the stream, I was going to uh, thank everyone for, you know, hitting the goals. We've just come a long way um, from just, you know, when I started and uh, got, you know, affiliate and uh, everyone kind of stuck, uh, you know, stayed around and, and there's so much that came from just outward. It's just, it feels great for, for everyone that just, you know, watches and, and hangs around and, and talks to me. So I, I really appreciate it. So, but yeah, of course, what else are we getting rid of here? Let's see. Possessed moon. We already have, Oh, I was going to take one of these. All right, here we go. The rust lich. Turn this off. Let's put the lantern, maybe just in case I need it. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Alright, dude, here we go. Whoa. There we go, that's one I was in. Got him. Oh, is it gonna be two? Oh. Excellent. There we go. Yes, we've got some great damage with the decay and ethereal right there. What is that? Over a hundred? That's 90. It's insane with this. Uh, I got to say the, the tenors, the tenorous brutes, even though I'm going to exchange them out, they really complement this two handed sword. So I may, just take them around with me um, because I want the antique plate for the additional mana and stamina cost, but the Tenorous boots really benefit um, the build. I may actually end up, um, they don't look too bad either. I may actually enchant these um, down the road for additional like movement speed and cooldown reduction but uh that was pretty good i was hoping to get him in in two but we did it that was a quick fight that was good yeah they they do they look really good and uh have the the enchant option is really good you chose this path lich Oh, now I can't move at all. <laughs> Let's see here. What's what's it do if I do this? Is this better? That's a little bit better. What about eat my? Do I have a? I have a pie, right? Yeah, I'll eat one of these. There we go. A little bit better. Let's see. I can equip this and put uh, all these here. Yep. And this. There we go. But excellent. We we still didn't get our purifying quartz, which is extremely unfortunate because now I have to make the tough decision to um, leave and get the quartz and then have to come back. Ooh, a gold bar. Um, and come back to um, the antique plateau because the enchant for the the antique plate boots requires me to be in the antique plateau, of course. 
Um, there's only one mob that I know of that is a hundred percent chance of dropping the quartz, and that's the one in Caldera. So it's uh ah man. What I may have to do is um I have to go get the backpack anyway, right? My my build it really kind of shines potentially with the dust backpack. I've kind of been missing it. So I have to go there and check for that, right? I may end up swinging by the grotto and taking care of that enemy that has the quartz. And then we'll have to see what we can do from there. Because I still haven't joined my faction mission. Good day. Um, I killed a rustler. Well done. Oh, thank you, sir. I wish it hadn't come to his death. I don't approve of what was done to him. You know, his outfit is amazing. I want it. What do you think the stats are on that thing? Looks Here's good. something you should know. I'm listening. This pains me. Will you tell the citizens? I don't see how we can without causing serious and unnecessary harm to Sorobor's reputation. Oh no, not the reputation. Enjoy your reward. I will. Oh, can't move. Man, I wish he gave a particle. All right, let's see here. I literally can't move. Let's see. Oh, the water, right? Let's dump the water. That's a little bit. What can I drink? I can drink one of these. What else? What else do I have? Um, get rid of one of these. And we can get rid of these. Drink one of these. These are what's really weighing me down. These horror chittens. I mean, the armor is too, but... Alright, that should be good enough for now. I'm a little slow, but I'll get there. It, uh, walking a little slow. This is my, uh, I beat the, the Rust Lich walk. It's my strut. There we go. Feeling good. All right, so what's next? I think we're going to have to just leave, right? We need to continue our adventure. We couldn't get the purifying quartz. However... If we want to enchant the Tenebris boots, we still need the Purifying Quartz, but that can be done anywhere. So technically, um, we can do that after we um, get one from uh, the horse in the grotto, maybe. And I think... Short-term goal, let's see where the the caravan takes us, and then we can branch from there. Because there's so many things we can do, right? So many paths to choose from, depending where the caravan takes us. Because if it takes us to Sierzo, we're going to hunt some pearl birds. If it takes us to Emmercar Forest, we're going to go to Caldera. If it takes us to the marsh, ooh, we'll probably just join the faction because that faction quest like takes us to Sierzo. And let's see, what else? If it takes us to Levant, ooh, that's a good question. What do we do there? Well, what do you need? Uh, I need some money. And I need you to, to buy this stuff. Do we want this stuff? We don't want this stuff, right? I mean... It doesn't give any ethereal damage. It gives decay. But, I mean, ours is better. Yeah, yeah, we don't want this. We don't want this. Let's sell this. That's just a lot of weight. We don't, we don't have a house. We need to sell this. And what else? We'll sell this. And these. 
that gem out of here. And what else? This. Um, I don't think we need the liquid corruptions. Okay. There we go. Looking better. Can I help you? I need your money. You don't have any money. Did I clean all these guys out? Need something. I think I think I did. Maybe not this girl. How can I help you? Okay, great. Perfect. Uh, actually, I think I'm. How can I help you? Missing these. I need these. I think that's the only thing that I don't have to make more horror weapons. All right, I can sell this now. We're gonna have to go through here and clean this backpack out. Um. Let's see, how many predator bones do I have? Okay, perfect. So, there's two. There's two. How many? Oh my goodness, I have four? Holy cow. Okay. I have way too much stuff. I'm going to have to sell this. Um, I don't think I need pure chitins, right? They You use them in a recipe, but I don't know if I actually need them. Let's sell this. I'm going to have to sell a lot of those. I have so much stuff in here. It's crazy. I'm going to have to get rid of a lot of the food that I'm not going to use. And I'll probably need to sell these. Alright, let's take this real quick and make the horror spear. Greetings, friend. Right. Greetings. Let's sell this stuff. Cool. Okay. And then what else? You better have the money. Oh, I got the money, dude. Don't you worry. Let's take that. Let's start up from the bottom here. Alright, so I can make one more. Sell that. What else? I know, right? He's so rude. It's like, bro, I I'm here to, to buy things. Of course I have the money. Of course I do. Giving me attitude over here. I just saved Harmatan. You know that Rustlich guy? Want to that buy was me. Something. I do. I want to buy Iron Claymore. Um... I don't have the cloth. Do you have cloth? Want to buy something? No, I don't need cloth. I have a ton of cloth. I gotta get rid of my own stuff. I don't wanna buy, keep buying more stuff. I'm, not, I'm not like a hoarder over here. I go to sell something, but I end up buying like four other things. It's like, no, man, you gotta... <laughs> Take this horror weapon and you better have the money. Don't make me get physical. Do I have any cloth? Yeah, I've got cloth. Okay. Perfect. This place is probably the next best place to sell horror weapons. Just because I think the increased buy, buy prices, something. right? No, it's still the same. It's the increased... Yeah, okay, I was thinking the other way around. Let's see, there we go, okay. So let's sell these. I'm going to have to start selling some stuff here we'll have to just make a lot of this stuff all right do i want the sar fist i guess the only reason why i'm keeping the sar fists is just in case i make a knuckle build and use them i mean they don't do anything maybe i don't want to use them maybe i don't want to make a, a knuckle build <laughs> i don't know what to do um i can use this what what can i sell though Let's sell some of these. Um, just because I've got some in the other bag. And I'm you know what? I'm gonna sell the tripwire traps. And some of this, because I have all this stuff in my other bag. Let's sell these. 
I need to make sure I have at least two coils for the the parallel quest in Sierzo. Um to give to what's his face? I can't remember his name. To fix the water purifier. So I just need to make sure I have two. Okay. So I can sell these three and keep those. Okay, what is else is in here that I can sell? This stuff all weighs like nothing. The wheat doesn't though. That needs to, this stuff needs to be sold. Quite a bit of this. Let's see, I can sell that. Sell these. I can sell. Let's start with seven of these. And what else are we going through? Holy cow. Ten. Sell this. I'm going to have to sell some of this food. I know that. I'm just trying to get like the big, the big items that I know that just won't last. Um, sell all this, these. This, all right, these, okay, this, this one. All right, cool. Okay, I need to find someone else who's got money. Who else has the money, buddy? You better have the money. Bro, are you and the other guy like brothers? I have the money. The matter is, is do you have the money? All right. I'll tell, you know what, I'm, I think I'm going to sell these. I don't think I'm going to keep them. I don't think on my agenda is um, a knuckle build yet. Like, I want to play one. Don't get me wrong. I just don't. It's not on my immediate plan to make one. Because um, I was thinking maybe a potential like a, a cool like a CDR, like a cooldown reduction build next. Let's sell, let's sell all those. We've got the other ones in there. There we go. Okay. That's looking better. What about... Yep, one of these. Honestly, as much as I want to take the... The Perpkins, we may have to think about getting rid of those. Um, I lost that gun sigil I was playing to the shark arena. Oh yeah, were you doing were you doing a hardcore? Were you just doing like a normal one? That shark arena is probably one of the hardest ones, in my opinion. That one is so tough. How can I help? You? It's crazy. Is there something you need? Like I can never get down their movement. Especially, like, Can one of them you? is tough, like, let alone three of them. Need something? Yeah, my friend on Tim. Oh, yeah, there you go. Yeah. It, it, their, their movement is almost worse than the beast golems. Because the beast golems, they, you know, they go back and forth and around. Want to buy um, something. But it's pretty straightforward, like, the beast golems. You know, they go sideways and then sideways or, like, sideways straight. But the sharks, man, Can I help they you? just circle around you. It's awful. All right, I need some money to leave. Okay, perfect. But man, good. I mean, that's a pretty good run, though. Getting all the way out there. And I feel like losing to an unknown arena or dying to an unknown arena, that's a good way to go, right? You were able to get through and do everything. Um, the traps hard counter are, uh, sigil and totems. Oh, sure. Yeah. Yep. Look at this. Look at all this. That's crazy amount of gold, man. I'll have to think about that next time I want to come out. There's still so much I need to sell. So I don't know what to do. I think I need to sleep a few days. I think that's what I'm going to do. Just while we're, um chatting and thinking about this let's get a plant tent so it can feed us 
Greetings, friend. Um, and I don't have any money. That's right, I can sell one of these. Um, because there's so much we're gonna have to sell. And no one has any money anymore. I bought the I bought the town. I own this place. Let's see, okay, I'm on a Spellblade Shaman Speedster and it feels Oh yeah, that's great. Speedster is really good. That's my next potential one. I'll either do an Ice Sigil Speedster or a potential two-handed Spear Speedster. Um, uh, speedster works well with Chakram. Is that what you're saying? Or um, you have Chakram with that build? Because um, either way, I agree. I love Chakrams. I'm a big promoter of chakrams all right so i think i think i'm gonna get rid of this armor right i brought it along with um uh, also hailberg yep yep i agree that hailberg i'm a, i like the spears move set over the hailberg um but the hailberg is they're usually stronger because um uh, there are potential better Hailbergs out there that do specifically like the the Immaculate one. That one's great um, if you can use it with like Speedster and everything. Um, I think I'm going to get rid of this armor. The idea was to hold on to it to fight the Liches. But now that we have like our potential full armor build... He might be harder, but I have everything that boosts it up. And it's just more weight that I cannot carry. Um, so let's figure out exactly what else we can get rid of now. Definitely these. Let's do two of these. Um... I may just have, I may end up, you know what, let's get rid of these. I'm going to have to just build up from scratch. Um, let's see, let's get rid of the fish. Yeah, honestly, I think I'm going to have to just build from scratch and get rid of this stuff. Um, we can take seven of these to sell they don't weigh anything but just to get things out of there and same with this stuff all right let's see what else um no like i, I do have one but i since i haven't joined a faction quest the stash is still at my lighthouse so I'm kind of, uh, I'm wandering around hoboing it. This is going to be my problem right here. These horror chittens. Yeah, so I uh, I started with Chersonese to give you a quick rundown. I explored and got all the uniques. I went to Emmercar for Forest and um, whatchamacallit, uh, did all the uniques and the elementals. Did Abersar, the the chest run, uniques, elementals, and then I came out to Harmattan. Um, but you're absolutely right. That's what I should look at first. Before I slept, Three I should have looked at that. Yes. Okay, so Berg is good, but you're right. I should cycle to Sierzo so I can just like roll my trunk on my backpack all the way up to my space. So that's what I'll probably do. Let me sell these this armor real quick. These guys should well, have reset a little bit. Yes, perfect. Let's get rid of that. And what else can I sell? Uh, just a lot. Yeah, it, it really is. And I don't, I don't want to leave it. And I was hoping to get it to the point where... Let me sell that. Um... I could get it to around the ideal value or the weight 
would be like around 120, 125, because then I could Can still I like you? walk to wherever I needed to go. But it just makes sense, right? To just, since he cycles, you're right. That's what I should do. I should just wait it out till Sierra, so, which hopefully will just be one more day since I already slept for two. Let's get rid of all this stuff. Um, I can turn these in, but I can only turn in two, so we'll sell one. I know it scraps down to a palladium, but there we go. Okay. Yep. Yep, I agree. Because then you run into other things that you could just <laughs> um, pick up, and now all of a sudden you can't walk. All right, let's go 24 hours. Hopefully, that'll be the third day and it'll be something different. That's what I've always thought, too. Um, absolutely. If you could sleep for multiple days, because doing that like seven days in a row is a huge pain. Yes. Okay, still Berg. Or even if, even if there was an option for that, but you had to go to an inn. I would gladly pay 50 silver to sleep multiple days in one setting instead of having doing like 24 hours. Greetings, friend. Yes. Stillberg. Come on, buddy. Give me a good one. It's rough. I, I have a feeling the next one's going to be like the hollowed marsh. And if it is, I might actually take it. So we'll split that down to 50-50. If it's hollowed marsh, I'll take it. Because um, I'm going to join and buy the player house right away. Greetings. Yes. Still Berg. Bro, who's paying you to keep it on Berg? No one wants to go there. Stop that. All right, we can do this. Come on, buddy. Greeting. Yes. No. I might actually um, step out to the antique plateau area if this doesn't work. Just to be like a quick um, reset. Sometimes I feel like, <laughs> right? They're always about the business. Greeting. Yes. No. All right, let's step out here. Maybe just a quick reset. Because that was like, is it possible for him to, to do Berg twice? Is that even possible? I mean, I guess it is, right? That's a really bad... What am I looking at? A 1d4 die to roll. be the next thing i could go to the main menu but i don't want to do that i already had to do that earlier this morning for the the flame greetings friend yes all right we'll try one more time we'll do that we'll do just in the morning maybe he's a a berg nighttime in a, in a sierzo morning time i don't know <laughs> just trying to tell myself different things All right, dude. Greetings, friend. No. Yes. All right. I don't know how many times I'm going to do this. Otherwise, I may just end up taking Berg and then um, where would I run to? I mean, probably the probably the Hollowed Marsh just because we can start our faction quest there. All right. Let me just see anything else. Greeting. Yes. All right, dude. You're upsetting me now. All right, let's pick this up. What's my weight on this thing? 163. That's awful. All right, I don't need these. They don't weigh anything, but I want to just, I guess, clean it up so that I can see a little better. Yeah, I can't do this. <laughs> There's so much stuff. It would take an hour for me to just figure that out. Are you kidding me? <laughs> There's so much stuff in there. The main problem are there's are the horror chitons. Um, 
You know what I should... Honestly, we've slept enough that the alchemist probably reset. She may have um, some more occult remains. Greetings, friend. Yes. Yeah, let me, uh, let me see if I can get some more occult remains. Because that's the only thing... No, I'm missing predator bones, too. How can I help you? That's what I'm missing. Well, she reset, but she still doesn't have any occult remains this time. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Because I can leave this tent. The tent I can get again. I'm not worried about the tent. I'm not worried about the alchemy kit or the cooking pot. It's all of the other stuff in there. And honestly, the thing that I would potentially leave are the horror chittens. I have enough money, but it would be nice to actually, like, get more money. I don't know. I'm greedy a little bit. Like, there's no reason to leave them if I can just get this guy to send me somewhere else. Greeting. Right? Yes. Bro, I will do this one time and then I think I'm just going to leave it. Because uh, that's four of them is what, like 24 weight? Um, down the uh, elevator to the little horrors for predator bones. Yeah. I know that. I think. I think I'm just. Because we haven't explored the hollowed marsh, like, at all. So there's a lot of money there still. And I have a lot of money. And I don't plan on, like, spending a lot of it. Greetings, friend. Yes. Yeah, okay. We're going to do that so that we can kind of move this along. I think we're just going to end up. Let's see here. Because um, this is where the big weight is, right here. The 16 weight. So now that we've dropped those, which is unfortunate. Yeah, the only thing that I'm missing is the, the skills in the Hollowed Marsh, because we've never been there. And then the next one is... There are two skills in Sierzo that I missed. The the pommel strike that I think you get from uh, Burak. I think he teaches that to you. Um, as well as the the extra impact when blocking that you get from Eto. I forgot those two skills, but the holy mission takes you to Sierzo, as well as I I haven't done the vent uh, vendaval either um so like i need to go to sierzo after i start my faction so everything kind of lines up so if he could change to either sierzo or hollowed marsh or monsoon i would take it um but he's just not changing yeah they they do yep i have, absolutely agree all right so what's the big thing here um this is three and this is four. I'm going to have to. Uh, let's see. I'll keep. I could just keep one of these. Two of these. One of these. I'm keeping those. Um, drop. Oh, not the spiritual varnish. No. There we go. The bread. You know what? Let's hang on a minute. This is what I'm gonna do instead. I'm gonna I'm gonna physically sell. Oh, those are really cool. Not often do you see like what they look like on the ground. It's pretty nice. I'm gonna throw things in here, right? That makes more sense. Um, let's see. I have so much food. Put all these in here. Flour, cream. Yep, I'm just gonna have to like get this stuff all over again. Well, when I go to the next area. Sell that, sell those. Just gonna have to sell it. Uh, the Sarwab. You know, I don't. I don't think so. I think I'm gonna try to stick with my um, runic weapons 
I'm going to try to do mostly like a, a mage build, but also like if I do any kind of melee, it's with the magic weapon to kind of fit my play style. Um, plus our armor gives bonus to both decay as well as ethereal. So that's where a lot of my boost from the weapon comes from, which is really nice. Um, I'm going to have to get some more of those. Let's see here. I don't want to sell the Livy Weed if I don't have to. It's really strong. Let's sell these. Okay. Does any... This one. Maybe sell three of these. Okay. So now let's drop this. Nope. I got so many backpacks lying around here. Alright. Let's take all this. Now we can sell all this. Yeah, much I faster. I was actually talking about that. It would be so like so OP if the the speed was actually like uh 1.1. 1 .1. It's currently 1. Point, um what did I do? Yes. It's 1.0, just like a straight 1. But then I was thinking, yeah, it would be almost too good if it was like 1.1 1. 1. cuz sometimes I feel like it's just a little too slow compared to some of to some enemies but i mean it's still good it's better than the star right I, I can't complain too much plus all the bonus damage i get from it all right what am i looking at now okay 100 so i can take this and the backpack and now this stuff and i'm gonna dump these that's a big one too yeah, that's what I thought too. That's that would help. You know, it's it's not a damage type that can be resisted very well. All right, so now we're good. We've got a, a ton of money. The only thing that we're really upset about are these uh, horror chitons. We still can't move though. What's um? Throw that out. Um. Let's see. Let's go sell. Now that we have everything in my backpack, let's fat roll to one of these guys all right dude you better have the money need something yes all right let's just get everything everything's one except for that one that one's two and not this one I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sell my marathon potions I'm gonna use those Right, gotta sell all this stuff. Okay, there we go. Yep. Man, I don't I don't want to sell this. These things are so good. Um, let's get rid of these. And some dreamers root. There we go. Same with the cheesecake. I'll sell that though. How many palladium scraps do I have? Okay, so I can get rid of these. I actually don't think I need any of the dark stones, even combinations. These are five weight? Holy cow. Well, I'm not going to sell those, though. Are you crazy? I don't want to sell. That's no point in selling that. Let's see. How much money do we have? Seven. Okay, let's go to the gems now. Two. One. There we go. Okay, now what do I look like? 26. Okay. I think I'm going to deal with that. I really don't want to. I'm going to have to leave the horror chittens. I know that it is an awful feeling, um, but I can't combine anything. I have no predator bones, no cult remains. Nobody's selling it. We're going to sleep one more time. That way, if it's monsoon... I know, right? Don't make me feel that... <laughs> Rain! <laughs> I don't think I have... I, all I have is like a rip. I don't have uh, anything. I know, I have so much money though. Like, I, I, can't, I can't think about it. I'm only doing this one more time. Okay, the snow is gone. We have a new season. Let's see. 
Sierzo? Greetings, friend. Yes. No, he's still Berg. Okay, I'm not going to do this. I, I don't want to spend the next, like, week and a half just praying that he's going to change his mind and take me to Sierzo. So, we have enough money. Um, I actually need to get Greetings, some from him. Friend. As well as some rations. Three rations. Actually, we can sell some of this, right? Two of these. And there we go. Is it just Greetings, two? Friend. Yes. Yes. Okay, I guess I'm going to Berg. That's it. I had to I had to leave him there. Rip horror chittens. But I think we we must have slept for what? At least five? Oh, at least five days. Probably more. It, I want to say five to seven days we've slept. And uh Nothing. This worries me. Like, he didn't change whatsoever. So now I need to... I'm going to buy three more travel rations. And... Um, you know what? Honest... Uh, you know what I didn't think of? She sells predator bones. I probably should have brought two horror chitons because I knew we were going to Berg. Hey, that. Yep. Her role is anywhere from like three to five. That's what I should have done. Because then I bet you this alchemist over here is going to sell occult remains. Let's take a look real quick. Because that's all I needed. I know, right? He was trying. He was like, go to Berg. Go to Berg. Oh, she doesn't have it. Okay, totally worth it then. We got lucky. Cause that's probably the only person I think who's gonna sell cult remains. Let's see. How can I help? Here's the plan. Yes. I'm going to monsoon. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's got the luxury backpack. We're gonna have to come back to get that. I don't wanna. I don't wanna buy it. That's six weight that I can't use. Now essentially, I'm gonna be breaking my back all the way to monsoon. That's where we're going now. I'd love to... I mean, there's so many things I want to do. Like, if I had infinite weight, I'd go to Caldera right now so that I can get a chance for my backpack as well as go to the Grotto for the Purifying Quartz. Um, and then I'd come back and go to Monsoon. Ah, so many things to do on the list. Luckily, the, the Tenorous Brutes look cool so I can use those for now uh, for the build plus they they actually do better like bonus to my damage um, but if once we can get the enchant on our antique plateau boots I think that's gonna be like a better quality of life we'll get the same amount of mana cost reduction but we'll get more stamina cost reduction so but this works plus we'll get the protection that we need well i think it's like three protection yeah so then our, our protection is going to go up to like 13 or 15 or something like that it'll be crazy all right here we go Um, you got to combine every arena boss mat in a sequence to make. Wouldn't that be crazy? What would it even look like? That would be insane. Have this like crazy image. Yeah, there goes all my food. I should have just sold all the food. I don't know what I was. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even change backpacks. I wasn't even thinking. I was thinking about like Caldera and those horror uh, chittens that we had to leave. Didn't even change my backpacks. Now all this food's going to rot. All right, which way should we go? Um, we gotta, we're gonna go this way. We're gonna open up the bridge. Oh, this is gonna be rough. I'm like completely out of stamina and these puppies are fast. Hurry, come on, you can do it. 
Okay, cool. Alright. So we're going to quickly grab the idol and um, go back to the bridge before my guy like dies here. Um, what other stamina can I eat? I don't have any of the booleans. I guess I can eat the perpkin. This gives three stamina, right? Oh, four? Oh my gosh. Those things are amazing. I didn't realize it gave four. It's like the best food in the game. That impact up. Alright, what am I doing? I can't loot anything. <laughs> Stop looking at the junk piles. Move the load this a little bit. There we go. Drink another water. Perfect. Yeah. Cheesecake. All right, we're at the skeleton. Ow. Ow. There we go. Alright, I'm taking the core remains. That's all I'm taking. I swear. As much as getting punished looter, uh, mentally never... Yeah, right? It never... Like, I want to take... I just want to loot stuff. Just let me loot. What do you got? I'll take that. And I'll take that. All right, I'm done. I swear. Not really. But I'll pretend. All right, let's uh, change your outfit. There we go. We got to keep an eye out for... Um, I don't know why I'm going over here. <laughs> it's a chest. I need it. We'll take that. Oh, that's a silver helm. Um, we got to keep an eye out for the caravan. I'm going to take... Like the side road up. Where the giant's village is. And there's... You can... There's a couple different areas you can see from up there. Um, we need to look, keep an eye out for him. Wait, can I go this way? Is this all unlocked? Right, okay. I don't want to go up to the... No, it's not. Okay, I didn't think so. I was like, there's a reason why I always went this way. Yeah, stay away from him. Oh, nope. He's coming. I don't want to mess with him. There we go. Let's take a little cat, cat rope walk. Perfect. Thank you. I know there's a unique in here, but I can't think about any of that. We'll come back and we'll clear this place out, just like we did the rest of them. But right now, we just need to get to Monsoon. I need my player's house so that I can dump all of this stuff in here. I've, I have always have this problem. Every playthrough I have, this is always like uh, what I have to go through, I guess you could say. Um... What am I getting rid of? Two of these. Yeah, there we go. Um, Cause depending on my build and how many, um, he's not gonna let me in. How many uh, places I have to go. I always end up with too much stuff. Where's the other one at? He's down there too. 
Um, this one was just a little harder because I went from Cherisenes to Emmercar to Abrasar up to the Antique Plateau. And... That one, uh, that was a lot, but we needed the armor, right? And I was really hoping that I could get all my enchants, but I got really unlucky with the purifying quartz. Let's see, I got a marathon potion. Now is the best time to use it. There we go. Alright, so we got to keep an eye out for the caravan. There's a couple spots. That he could be, if we get lucky. Yeah, the tough and very useful. Yeah, and see, there's only one enemy who has a guaranteed um, drop of those. And, of course, it's in Caldera when you don't really need to go there. And normally, by the time you get to Caldera, you have all your enchants. So, Caldera is kind of like the catch-22 of extremely useful but not at the time you need it if that makes sense right because there's so many things that are useful there but only it's useful like in the beginning of the game not not when you can get it in caldera so i was uh hoping for some good uh drop rates from some of like the shield golems Yeah, and that's what I did, right? Like, so we spent the last couple streams hunting, doing, like, the clockwork puzzle. And I think out of all of them, so ten of them, that you could do, like, the first five, and then when they're at the plaza, only one purifying quartz dropped, which was just terrible luck. And all the other ones through the dungeons while we were doing the rust lich never dropped any. And then I found one more off of a shield golem. And so I was hoping that I would get another one when I fought the the shield golem, but right before the rust lich. But he didn't drop one. So it was just like, it was just really bad luck. So I don't see him. I'm kind of looking over there to the west, southwest. Because he could be right there. And then another one is right up here. Uh, by the wall. And actually, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Is this him right here? Do you guys see him? Is that it? I'm going to go that way. Unless that's... <laughs> Just like a mountain. We're going to find out. No, I think that might be him. All right. I don't know how to start like a... Uh, a channel points bet. I was going to... I need uh, I need to figure that out. So that we can start doing... Uh, Yes and no's for the Master Trader Boots. I don't know. How, I, I need to figure it out. That would be a good one to do, right? Anybody want to spend some channel points on if I'm going to get uh, these Master Trader Boots? That way we can uh, maybe get some uh, lurkers to uh, spend some points. All right. What's the over-under? Come on, buddy. I need them. I know I gotta I gotta get some uh I don't have any mods at the moment, but uh but yeah, I'll have to set that kind of stuff up. Alright. Cause that would be fun, right? I think that would be a good one to do. I gotta write that down. Alright, what do we what do we got? I need Greetings, it. Friend. I need it. No, you don't sell anything? What is wrong with you? Hold okay, so this is why. You know what? It's because I didn't bring my tent, right? Is he laughing at me? That's what he's doing. I didn't bring my tent, so he's offering me three of them. Are you kidding me right now? 
three luxury tents, bro. Bro, this is insane. You know what? I'm not going to buy from you. No. I'm going to go buy from the one in Berg. I'm not giving you my money. Oh, my goodness. It's a hard troll. Are you kidding me? I've hit every single one in every area. I've done the one in Emmercar Forest twice. Um, I actually don't think I found him in Chersonese. No, no. I did one time outside of the Cabal Tower, and he didn't have it. And then I found him in Abrasar one time, because that's the harder one. And he didn't have it. I actually found him twice in the Antique Plateau, which is surprising, because that one's harder. And of course he didn't have it, but his loot table is a lot bigger in Abrasar. Or, um... Antique Plateau, sorry. Man, this guy. All right, we made it. Our guy's going to keel over, but it's worth it. He slept like a week, so I don't want to hear any complaining from him. We can finally start our, after how many streams of this of this particular run, we're finally starting our faction quest. It's been a journey. We can do it. What's up, girl? Well met, friend. Um, the journey was a lot harder. It's been days. I've joined the holy mission. Oh, yeah? Have you given my previous words any thought? Uh, yeah, I have. If you choose to join us, you should speak with Cardinal Bolamac. Okay. I will do that. I'm not even talking to you, Caravan. I don't want to talk to you. I'm going to get my money from somebody else. Cardinal Bolamac. Blessings of Elat upon you. Um, uh, I'm curious about joining the Holy Mission. Joining the Holy Mission of Elat is not a decision to be taken lightly, Pilgrim. Okay. To serve Elat's cause is to accept the three tenets of the Endless Path. Okay. And never forget the Scourge knows us. Oh, if I do this, um, I forfeit the Immaculate's Weapon. I forgot about that. Because I haven't talked to him. I think the Hollowed Marsh is the last one that I haven't talked to him. That's okay. I wasn't going to use the weapon, and we have a ton of money, so it's not a big deal. Uh, I'm not afraid of anything. This is your task. Listen well. Got it. Do I have a... I do. I have a discipline potion here. So let's just talk to Zephyrin. Let's talk to our boy. What's up? How can I help you? I'm considering joining the Holy Mission. Let me take a look at you. Ah, I see potential there, but it's very much a gem in the rough. What? Dude, I defeated the Rust Lich. What have you done? I can definitely tell you've got the spirit for it, but you need discipline. Discipline. Right, that reminds me. Yes. If you can't find one for me, it's pretty easy to brew. I do it. I got one. Uh, friends with the Mega instead of Sworn Enemy. Yeah. Yep. That's why That's why I've... Holy Mission used to be my, like, favorite, but then I think it slowly becomes Sorobor. I just... I love the Antique Plateau so much. Like, there's just something about that area that I just really like. Um, I've got thanks that potion. Bunch. Hey, nice. by way of thanks, do you want to know how to make a warrior's elixir? Uh, sure. Uh, nice meeting you both. Always strive to be better than today. Let's take this. Yoink. You saw nothing. Yeah, it's just so cool. Especially in the winter. I know it's really harsh in the winter, but it's just so beautiful. It's crazy. I like it. I have called on Elat. He has been watching you. Ooh, you don't say. Should we take a, uh... 
take a screenshot for any present or future thumbnails. Let's see here. Take one here. Mom, I've joined the holy mission. Don't wait up for me. There we go. All right, Alat, what's up? Welcome. I am uh, fire spell is great for cold Welcome water. Yeah. Oh yeah, because you get the bonus from the weapon. Yeah, the like the extra weather, hot weather. All right, how did you do it? Is there a sorcerer hiding inside the altar? Ha! Do you wish to check for yourself? Oh, totally solid. Indeed. I assure you, I'm the genuine article. Oh, Not nice. So okay. Uh, do I have a place in I the holy mission? I sense a certain potential in you, waiting to be forged into something stronger. Okay. Always remember the three pillars of our cause. Oh, okay. I guess I never, I mean, I knew the torch work really would. I guess I never realized um, the weapons did that. Because I, I know the sigils did too, right? Like if you put a fire sigil or ice sigil down, you could cool your weather or your uh, temperature. I never, I never actually thought about the weapons on it. That's pretty cool. I like it though. Uh, that depends what happens when I join you. Ah, you're thinking. Good. Uh, yes, I commit myself to your cause. Yes. Then it is done. I welcome you into my heart and grant you the title of missionary. Ah. Eleonora will give you tasks on Eleonora. To narrow my focus to any precise place or person blinds me to events going on everywhere else. Please. Oh, nice. Listen. Uh, I'll have to check. It's been a while since I've done, um, like, Hall Frost weapons. I like them. They're really cool looking. It's too bad that you can't enchant them. Like, I understand why they did that. Um, but they look so cool. Uh, I wish we could enchant them. All right, Eleonora. What do you have for me? Well met, friend. Well met. I can only hope. I suggest you look into a situation that works. Oh, okay. Burak, the warlords. Oh. Take your time getting familiar with the marsh. I will go there right now. After I get my player house. I'm going to talk to this guy. I'm not talking to the caravan. Is, uh, I'm mad at need? him. I need money, buddy. Let's sell this stuff. And that. What else? And then two... I'm going to make it. I'll make it. We can do it. It's too bad. You know what? I, I kind of wish that the purifying quartz could almost get dropped off of other unique enemies as well. Um, Something on how can I help you? Uh, I know that they drop off elementals, right? It's a small chance. All right, nice. but it would be kind of nice if they were also in the world, or maybe I just don't know it. Like in ornate chests, like maybe they can drop in ornate chests, but not in the the base world. Which I wish they they could, if that makes sense. All right, let's see here. What's in here? Okay, definitely get rid of these. Oh, really? Oh, that's weird. How they wouldn't do that. Oh, nice. Definitely take that. Yeah, I have more particles here. Yeah, no more quartz. Got more of that stuff, though. Excellent. What do we got here? Dumping, like, all of this money. So much weight. This. This. These. So much stuff. Um, five. All of these. There 
go. Put all this stuff away here. Um, I'll put this one away. I'm gonna wear this one. Where did this one go? Until I get my other backpack. There we go. Look at that. Much better. Put all these there. All right. Cool. We're going to finish up. All right. So that is going to call my stream for today. Let me get some good light in here. Um, we'll, we'll do tomorrow. We'll do a bigger prep to make sure that we have everything that we need in our backpack. Um, and then we're going to head right back to Chersonese. We need to have some harsh words with some pearl birds, as well as take out these warlords that are causing a ruckus for Sirzio. So we're going to... Did I start it already? Yeah, yeah. We talked to Eleanor, right? Eleanor, so we got these bad boys going. So we got Vendival and Questions and Corruption. So we got those started. So that that way we can head um, straight to Chersonese um, for Vendival. And then we'll come back to do Corruptions. And then we'll go back again to uh, Chersonese. Because that's the way that it works. But, I mean, that's okay. It's It works for us. Because that way we don't have to, like, just sleep to skip time. I try to avoid that if possible. Um, but clearly it was not possible when I was in Harmattan because that guy didn't want to take me anywhere except for Burke. But I wanted to take this time um, to thank everyone who has been kind of just watching me and following me. Um, we've hit our follower goal, which is amazing. Um, I don't really know uh, what to do with some of these goals. I feel like it's just nice to have a goal. And, you know, the first one was 50 and now it's 75 and I think the next one will probably just be a hundred and then we'll just kind of keep it going. But each time, um, at, I just wanted to at least stop and say, um, thanks to everyone who, um, is watching the stream or lurking or watches the stream after the fact on YouTube or whatever. Um, I appreciate it a lot and I like to do whatever I can for the outward community. Um, because this game is amazing um, I will more than likely try to branch out and do some other streams, but I don't know exactly what I want to do. Um, Starfield is coming up. Um, that would be kind of cool to take a look at if it's, um, uh, worth streaming. Um, I know that the cyberpunk's also coming out, um, but I don't know how, what people think about, um, games with mods if that's a hit or miss, because I know Cyberpunk is one that I would love to play again, but I have to play that modded. Like, there's just so many things that get um, better with mods, but I don't know how the, the community or people who watch streamers like mods. So that's all something that we can kind of talk about. But uh, anyone who was here today, again, uh, thank you so much, uh, Doc was in here early with a raid, and I uh, so appreciate that. And then Abjorn, as always, uh, thanks for coming in and chatting with me. It's always nice to uh, to chat with you, sir. Um, and anybody else who was lurking, um, Unicyclic, thank you. Um, I always love your uh, inputs on uh, This Worries Me, as well as uh, uh, <laughs> making me feel good about leaving those horror chittens. <laughs> so everyone um thank you again and i will get this uh stream up on uh youtube probably later today uh tomorrow morning so wherever you are please have a great morning afternoon evening uh thank you so much